What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Jump on our exit because that episode of Sky Cap Hill Project. With that being said, let's get into today's episode as we're we'll getting into industrial foregoing. Alrighty, guys. So before we can get into industrial foregoing, we need to get into a little bit of thermal. Um, I was taking a peek at the quests. And we need to make the magma crucible and the fluid encapsulator to make the progress to unlock industrial forward going. Now you may have noticed, like, I'm pretty sure the quest, you see how this, this one has like circle, like a circle uh, quest pattern thingy. This one has a gear pattern. So I'm, I'm wondering if the gear pattern means like this quest unlocks something. I'm wondering if that's the case. That's a shop. Um, maybe for the tier two stuff. I don't know. But anyways, we need to do these things. So I think we already have most of what we need here, which is pretty good. Uh, we need two machine frames for starters. And then we need Invar gears and the reception coils, which we don't have. Fair enough. Fair enough. Two gold, actually no, one gold, sorry. We we can just, uh, do we even have any of the coils? We do, okay. So we have the other one, but not this one. Good, 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 good. In between episodes, I did do a little bit of work in terms of getting some EMC going or uh, upgrading tier two stuff, getting more tier two stuff down so that way we can have more diamonds coming in, uh, you know, faster. So that way we can have more EMC much, 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 much more faster. I mean. It's probably not that much faster. It's probably like a 10% increase if I had to guess um, how much I um, I put in, I think. Uh, I didn't put that, you know, it, it's very expensive, right? It is very expensive to upgrade tier two. I believe it's, what is it? What is the, um, for one tier two, it is 871,000, almost a million EMC per one, um, what should I call it? Uh, one capsule Also keep in mind that the the mini ca it's a mini capsule, right? It's not a full capsule So yeah, it's very 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 expensive Unfortunately, so we'll go ahead and teach this invar Which is gonna require us to grab some of this Shenanigans out of the, the table here There we go and let's, let's mm, You know what? Let's just let's do it all at once, right? We might as well, right? Because why not? Iron. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna need more of this later, but sure, whatever. We'll, we'll, you know, make do with what we got. Beautiful in our gears, and then you know, do the thing. I wish they just gave us the Toma knowledge from the start. I mean, to be fair, I don't know. Th that seems a little busted though. Uh, we need glass and nether brick, which I believe we have both of those things. Uh, it's just one glass to nether brick. Um, nether brick. Perfect. I'm pretty sure I've made a magma crucible. I thought I made a magma crucible. Maybe I'm mistaken. Now nah, there we go. Magma crucible done. That is probably the easiest thing in my entire life. I swear. I'm going to get rid of all of this here for a sec. Uh, glass panes, copper gear, coil, and a bucket. I wonder what this fluid encapsulator is going to... You know what? It's probably going to be something to do with the... Um, uh, whatchamacallit? God, I can't think of the name of it right now. Um, the latex. There we go. The latex. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what it's called. Latex, baby. Okay. And then this should be the fluid encapsulator basically done for the most part. We do have... Glass panes. Oh my god, we've been waiting so long to use these glass panes. We're only gonna use two of them. Unfortunate. S significant skill issue. Can I click the damn thing? Thank you. Wait a second. Did that just tell me no? Don't you don't you dare tell me no? Because it's right. Right? Nope. Why won't this take glass pane? Hold on. I'm gonna force it to take it. Okay, there we go. Book it. Machine frame this and this okay it won't take it never mind <sighs> i guess they're going back in the chest 
They're going back in the chest. I don't know why I made those glass panes. I swear. I thought whatever I was making took the glass panes, but I guess not. All right. Fluid encapsulator. Easy said and done. And that should, in theory, unlock us the industrial four going quest. Maybe. Uh, yes. The pity machine frame is what we're looking. Oh, I see. Right. Right, 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 right. I see now. I see why we needed that for. Okay. That's right. Okay. Magma crucible and the fluid uh, encapsulator. And that's going to need power as well. You know, we'll do that right over here. So magma crucible with a fluid encapsulator. You're going to, you're going to do your, your, your thing. You're going to boop, 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 that, that, and that sure and then what we'll do is we'll just pop two different drawers like so now we don't really have a power situation right now right so we're gonna have to figure out what we're gonna do for power but i have a a, a pretty good feeling of what i know what i want to do for power uh something really easy and super simple and it's gonna require a little bit of not even that much work actually well hold on maybe maybe a little bit of work i'm not really sure the integral component parts Ooh, do these not do the hold on do the tier one and twos don't have any oh these don't have any well hold on the tier ones do but the tier two don't oh because we need signal um can i even make signal um right now uh i can if i make an induction smelter that sounds like a uh, a me problem uh sand and var and what was that again ah a blast furnace all right so we're gonna have to kind of kick boost this system up or for the start so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna get 10 sterling generators for now yeah because we need something here to to get at least get the the the, the ball moving so what we'll do is we'll just run 10 of these bad boys in a nice little configuration like that. And then energy pipes, I'm a little concerned about. Okay, no, they're they're not they're not terrible. Okay, they're they're pretty good actually. So energy pipes. Um what would be nice is maybe some upgrades. Okay. Uh, I need no 10 of them yes 10 of them I can I, I promise I can do math uh I'm not or did we end up making the oh my god stupid phantoms go away I'm just saying phantoms are the worst addition to minecraft ever go away seriously phantoms are the worst addition to minecraft ever I wish I can forever disable them under my account or something like I do not like phantoms at all. They are very annoying, especially when you're just trying to play a pack and enjoying, you know, building factories and whatnot. You get those stupid little pesky freaking phantoms that don't leave you alone if you don't sleep. It reminds me of like sleep paralysis or something or, or night terrors or nightmares or something, right? I don't know. They're not really scary, but they're just really annoying to deal with uh these pipes can do 8000 r per tick these aren't going to do 8000 r per tick so i'm pretty certain that uh we're pretty good on that that front uh we could also just set up like a little coal production area um you know or i can just yoink some coal from over here and call it a day <laughs> you know just yoink some coal you know what I have a really stupid idea and no one can stop me i'm going to literally run a pipe <laughs> from all the way over there yeah who's gonna stop me <laughs> you know what it isn't that bad honestly it really isn't i'm not gonna lie it i thought it was gonna be a lot worse than it was but it seems to be all right it's not too crazy right and now what we do is we just run pipes into these 
and then that should automatically just start pump uh not yet but i think if i do something like this it should just start automatically piping into those coal generators and then we should be able to now i'm going to run this actually underneath the area where we're going to be uh running our machines here so that way it doesn't look that ugly it'll look pretty uh pretty clean if you will i mean it's not as good as under ail pipes but you know it is what it is it is what it is so now that we have power now basic power it's very basic um <laughs> Two hours per tick. Uh, no, about 40 ish hours per tick, which isn't too bad. What we could do is just make a, a set of basic kits or something, like a basic integral component kit or whatever, which is just going to require some invar, some glass, and some gold, essentially gold gear, essentially. That's Constantine. Uh, right. What the reason why I'm pretty sure the, uh, tier two gear or tier two doesn't have a, a emc is because it has signalum gears which i don't know if you've noticed but signalum doesn't have emc so yeah that's probably why the upgrade kit doesn't have emc obviously you can go in if you want it to have emc you can go in and manually add it but i'm not going to do that because i want to play the pack how it was originally meant to be played so yeah we're not gonna we're not gonna be doing that today unfortunately not today, but maybe in another series, we might do that. I don't know. We'll see. We'll, 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 uh, we'll uh, play by ear. I'm just going to put all this away. Um, gold, redstone, glass, and then I believe also invar. It's like four invar or something. But what's really nice about this is like, I don't have to craft this again, right? I can just quickly make the, you know, grab the tier one kit if I want to, uh, to make tier two kits, which I do want to make tier two kits, but I don't think we're going to be able to make it right now. Actually, no, we can make it right now. Uh, hold on. Let's see. Uh, integral components, which are going to be signalum. Uh, if I want nine, I'm going to want it's times two. So 18 gears, 18 times four, which is 18 times four is going to be 72 signalum, which is a stack plus eight eight and we make four at a time so let me divide that by four i need to make 18 sets of this oh god i don't even know if i can do that can i even do that i mean obviously not not all at once unfortunately so copper, silver, and redstone. And it's also gonna be very slow. Copper, uh, silver, and redstone uh, are the things. And that should make signalum. You know what, this is probably a good time as, as is any to pop in one of these kits to make it a little bit faster. Uh, we could also, I believe, make speed upgrades. And you know, let me quickly grab all the diamonds that are in here because EMC. We're almost, we're almost there. We're almost able to make our first tier one, which is gonna be. Oh god, that's gonna be good. That's gonna feel real good once we're able to make that. Actually, and we should be able to. We we should be. Actually, no, wait, hold on. We're not quite doing it yet. Why are you not? Oh, you're not ejecting auto. And then, oh God, I need, hold on. Um, right. Okay. So I'm going to have to put a hole in the ground. <laughs> I know that's weird. Um, what is that? Gray, gray. Actually, hold on. I can also wait. <laughs> hey, stop it. I need to, I need to, <laughs> I need to put a, uh, a drawer down. Uh, does it have to be spruce or can it be any log? I think it'd be any log. Yeah, it seems to be any log. Let me just grab a ton of oak logs. And then this should allow us to make pity machine frames. 
unlimited unlimited pity machine frames for free dot com uh get your unlimited pity pity machine frames for free uh auto pull and export house is that working i can't tell if that's working oh my god it's working but it's incredibly slow how long i wish i told you how many ticks it's gonna take to make oh my god that's so slow oh my god what the hell it's so slow and just like that we got our first pity machine frame okay let's see what we can do here i think we can uh, do we have okay yeah we have a few so we're gonna want to take these i believe and we want to make our first tree fluid extract or no they're, oh, they're, they're, i hate the new i hate the new update for industrial four going because i'm so used to saying tree fluid extractor because i play a lot of minecraft 112 but in this it's just called a um fluid extractor it's gonna need cobblestone some weighted pressure plates and some iron okay easy enough also one of the reasons why i'm pushing for industrial four going is we can make spawners right we can make spawners and it's gonna be great <laughs> and then we can make things like uh zombified piglin spawners even faster also make it so we don't have to be standing right there for it to run that would be pretty good actually if we didn't have to be standing right there to make it work because yeah okay yeah we're gonna need a few of these uh i think i want four for now four should be plenty uh to get started uh cobble stone one two three four uh we need eight of those yeah so four of these should be good enough to get started all right good 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 perfect for these bad boys okay getting started all right all right so you're gonna come over here um yeah sure right here is fine you 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 and you do we have a block placer that i can use um one that ideally could place down facing up um i don't remember how i did this the last time uh factory was it like a factory hopper or something no 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 i'm pretty sure it was this mod uh the, 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 this mod here the Uh, modular routers. Yeah, the routers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The the routers mod here. The the yeah, this the modular router. Right, 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 right. I see. That's the mod that I was talking about. That yeah, modular routers could do a lot of. What did you spawn? What? Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna take care of this idiot. Modular routers is really really powerful actually so we're gonna uh, set this up the first thing that we need to do though is make sure that we get <clears throat> some paper wait do we have paper already uh no because we used it all okay fair enough uh use this and create paper or sugarcane to make some paper oh we already had some uh gold nuggy gold nuggies Mm -hmm. the golden nuggets and i believe some redstone some redstone as well good 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 uh blank modules uh blank modules with this good and then this should be really easy to set up so i just do something like this with a placer module uh excuse me game uh placer module 
uh, the placer module is just going to require a dispenser. Uh, so a bow. Okay, so a few things here. Okay, so sticks. Now, I don't have acacia wood. And I really like acacia wood because... Yeah, acacia wood apparently is the best wood for this. Uh, according to 112 at least, from what I remember. So I'm hoping that's still the, 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 the case in... Um, this version of Minecraft, but it might not be. So we are about to find out, aren't we? Uh, right. Uh, let me just quickly do this. Let me just quickly teach you how to make these things and then combine them together to make a dispenser and all the other things, dirt and dirty and I don't know, uh, grab you. And I should be able to make a placer module now. Good. Uh, this placer module, uh, there's gotta be an easier way to get acacia, right? I believe I can convert wood using, oh, that's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> wrong, wrong block. I think I can convert wood by using, yeah, jungle. Ah, oh, I just had acacia, damn it. Uh, spruce, jungle, acacia. You know, if we can get cocoa beans, this could be a really good EMC opportunity as well. Just saying, it could be a really good uh, EMC um, opportunity, potentially. Um, uh, a few of these things I don't really need. I don't I don't need any of those that uh, we can put these away. Uh, put these away as well. I mean, we'll use them eventually. Put this away, this away. Anything that doesn't have EMC can go in this chest for right now. Because we're not really using it, I guess. Uh, you on the up acacia wood white list and that should be fine So you should do that perfect and now I just I got all I gotta do is come down here With maybe like a drawer or something Right, that's not what I wanted to do Not that many drawers and then just fill this with acacia wood and I'm pretty sure don't also forget that in the, this version of Minecraft, God damn it! In this version of Minecraft, we also have the um, what is it called? The stripped, right? The stripped logs or whatever they're called. So yeah, that's pretty good. And then there you go. And then I should be able to just come over here with some of this and do a little bit of this action, and that will fill that. And now that's placing down a bunch of this acacia wood. Now, I don't know what giving this power does, but I remember it being buggy, buggy back in the, in the day. So I'm just not going to give it power. I, th I just think it's just smarter not to, to do it. If it's, if it was buggy in the past, who knows if they, it's gotten fixed or not. So I'd rather not run that risk. Right. So yeah, right. So now that we have this. What do we do with this, right? That, that's the, the question, the, the day old question. What do we do with latex? Uh, well, one, we need to get a bucket of it. So we should probably put it into a tank, I would assume, maybe. Um, maybe a very basic tank from a uh, mechanism. Yeah, one of these basic tanks would be just fine. So I'd assume we just take some, you know, good old fluid pipes the 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 fluid pipes from you know this 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 and do the whole configure thing this does 50 mil buckets per tick i don't know how many mil buckets this is producing per tick uh it looks like zero um I do want to, oh, I can't really do that from that one, can I? What I'll do is do some really sneaky stuff with this, and it's gonna be, it's gonna look cool, trust. And then you can come down. As long as I can still have access to the front of this block, I'm gonna give it power. I'm gonna see what happens. This is probably a bad idea, but sure, why not? It should be fine. 
Let's see. Is it gonna? It doesn't look like it's doing anything. It does look like it's producing more though. So that's that's pretty good. If that's the case. And now that we have this. Okay. That should be leading into this, right? Latex is a slow process, but is necessary to get uh, plastic for further machines. This extractor, the extractors do not require power. You can speed up the, the, the gathering of liquid latex by powering them or by adding speed slash efficiency add-ons to the extractors, though you will not be able to make those until a little bit later. Uh, technically, uh, typically you'll, you will lose your first bucket of latex to craft the latex processing unit. I will be nice and reward you with that item so you can get on your way. Oh, Pog. Okay. So you need a bucket or I need a bucket. Not you need a bucket. I need a bucket here. And then once we get a, our first bucket of latex, we should be able to, you know, start the process of processing our stuff our latex uh i believe i don't know if this pack has infinite water in the sense of like the sink we might need to set up an aqueous yeah we're gonna have to set up an aqueous accumulator which is fine right assuming that this takes water yep this indeed does take water so we're gonna have to set up one of those aqueous accumulators assuming we can make it right we should always, you know, for a safe bet, always assume that we can't make it until we check, right? Because sometimes we're not going to be able to make it. If this is a tier three item, I'm going to be very upset. <laughs> um, wrong letter. AQS accumulator. I'm pretty sure I have one. No, not yet. Uh, we need one of those servos. We have one of those. Do we have everything else? Copper, glass. Okay, so copper, it's four copper, uh, how many pieces of glass, two glass, one iron, and a bucket. Okay, what a recipe. You know, it doesn't require infinity ingots to make an infinite water source. Oh God, that's so funny. Uh, EQS accumula Oculus accumulator, get. And I should be able to just, well, I was going to come back here and do it back there, but it doesn't seem that that's going to be the case. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do something crazy. I'm going to that because I'm going to put the egg here and then hold on. I'm going to make sure that this is not doing what it's going to do. And then I need this. What is this? Gray cron gray concrete. Gray concrete. Concrete. And then you're gonna want water. So a oh, a one, a one. And it too, you're gonna also quickly do that. And do a little bit of that for me. Best part is this needs power. So we're gonna also run power right alongside this. Oh, this looks so jank, but you know what? I'm about the jank. All right, so you're getting the water, you're getting down the latex, you're doing all the things. Now we should take this tiny dry rubber, put it in our inventory. That's not a quest complete. 36 dry rubber. Are you on something? I think you're on something. Maybe that's what we need for the dissolution chamber. Maybe that might be what we need for the dissolution chamber. Yeah, nope, we need two plastic, which needs nine, which needs 18. Anyways, but we are out of time for today's episode. So with that being said, if you guys did enjoy today's episode of Sky Capture Project, please do me a huge favor. Smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, ding down that notification bell, become a part of the Hunter Tribe. Help us reach our goal of 1,000 subscribers. As always, guys, I'm going to love you. I'm going to leave you. Till next time. Bye-bye.